Yeah. Tell ya. Tell me what you think about this sign. I have to go for unsustainable for. Sorry, I'm dyslexic. Unsustainable for us. Change my mind. That's you watch us? Yeah, yeah. I love this video. So, what do you think? What do you think? Well, I don't know. I was supposed to change your mind. Well, why do you think it's unsustainable first? All right, so there's a lot to unpack, um, and it goes beyond unsustainability. It, it 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 dwells into the the damage that it's doing to the environment as far as. Uh, deforestation, ocean dead zone, uh, rapidly uh, killing more spe so species extinction, which is already happening. But so, are are you aware that it takes about 16 times more land and water to create the same amount of protein and calories with beef compared to lentils? Sure. So basically, what I'm saying is, if 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 we can eat less animal products and meat, that's where we can make the biggest impact on on the environment. Well, okay, for me, I'm biased. I'm a vegan. I I would rather you not eat. I, any animals, but that's more for ethical reasons. If we're just talking about the environment, eating le like, for example, grill station. There. I I work on the grill station there. If we just oh, serve yeah. Beyond Burgers, I, I don't know if you ever had a Beyond Burger. It tastes yeah. better than those burgers in there. If if we all collectively work together to do that, that that would be probably like like if, if this dining hall, for example, just on that grill station didn't serve meat, it could be. Yeah. Probably one of the most sustainable dining halls in America. Like it's, it's that big of an impact. Talking about 16 times less water and land. Like that, it's it's a pretty big deal. And okay, so the UN United Nations put out a peer-reviewed statement, also saying that America and the UK needs to cut down their meat and uh, dairy consumption by 90% by the year 2050 to avoid the two degrees Celsius rise uh, global temperature. And, and, and that's that's a non-biased, non-vegan like source. Basically, all the, all the top environmental scientists. I got this book over here. Uh, I've been reading Environmental Science, page 200. You can read about it. It says a lot of the stuff that I I just said. Then this other book here, they're biased, but still environmentalists. This book isn't biased. It's textbook. And then I have a bunch of charts on my phone. Just a bunch of just information explaining how it's. Uh, basically 16 times more land and more water uh, and ocean dead zones so are, are you aware of the runoff from factory farms going into streams going building up yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. so basically what I'm saying here is if, if we can all work together to get the same taste get the same texture which is out there people just there's oh, my God. oh yeah so so it's it beyond burgers are more expensive right now but that's that's not because of producing it that's because of the demand if more people demanded it, then the price would go down. So that's where the problem is. So that's why I'm out here. Because the more people that demand these products that are more sustainable, that use less water, use less land, the more the price goes down. Well, what do you say about nutrients then? Nut do you think you can get the same nutrients? Nutrients? Yeah. Yeah, burger, yeah. Like yeah. Oh, burger. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's got your full amino acids. Mm -hmm. So what are your concerns about Nutrients. Do you have any? I mean, most obvious one would be protein. Protein. Okay. Much. So Patrick Bamuian. Here. Um, Patrick Bamuian, world's strongman in Germany, vegan. The only uh, American weightlifter to make it into the Olympics, break a world record, vegan. I think his name was Ken Kendrick Ferenc or something. Just. Only American weightlifter to make it into uh, that John Venus bodybuilder vegan. Forget all those people. All you need to do is eat enough calories and have have a well balanced diet. Protein is is not a problem. Yeah. But I'm not even telling people to go vegan in this situation. I'm just saying eat less meat. Well, I can, I can be down with less. Yeah, that's understandable. Anything else? Um, you guys. About the runoff? Yeah, yeah. Are you talking about specifically in America the runoff? Yeah, so Gulf of Mexico yeah. is, is, is one example, yeah. From what I've seen is that uh, America is not necessarily the problem when it comes to pollution. It's like places like China and oh, developing yeah. countries that yeah, those a lot of uncontrolled emissions. I would, I would say they, they definitely uh, have way more of an impact, but we still have an impact. And, and like our food choices still uh, make a pretty big impact. Good point though. What does the Z mean? Okay, so my name is 